today we're going to talk about something super important, girls. Lashes. Yes. So yesterday I was looking up lash serums on Amazon and there are so many to choose from, but they are expensive. Some of them were $180. That's insane. Absolutely ridiculous because you have to continuously use this product at least twice a day as per all of the instructions just to get maximum benefit out of it. And you have to use it for a prolonged period of time. $180 every month. Like that's insanity. So this one right here from The Ordinary is actually only $7 Canadian, which is amazing. So I'm actually super excited to try this on and test it out and of course take you guys on this journey with me throughout the month as I try this on so I'm just gonna get started we're just gonna apply this I like this so far it's got this really cute applicator brush I love that just you know you can have a really nice clean line with that this is actually for brows as well as lashes which I love because I'm gonna zoom you guys in right here I have this little bald patch and I don't talk about it on my channel enough but the OGs to the channel know that I have had chemo in the past many, many years ago. I'm fine now. Everything's good. Relax. Everything's great. But it left me with this little bald patch right here on my brows. Of course, when you guys have chemo, if you guys aren't aware, you do lose some of your brow hair. You do lose some of your eyelashes. So my eyelashes are still very, very fine and sparse, but an amazing mascara fixes that right up. If you guys want me to do a video on my favorite, my absolute favorite mascaras, let me know in the comments down below. But today we're talking about lash. <laughs> All right, so let's just talk about this right here. So I do have the microblading in my brows but it is faded it's been a couple of years since i had the microblading so i'm gonna go in and just do my whole brow i'm gonna extend it because i actually wouldn't mind if i had fuller brows because back when i had these microblading brows done it was a huge trend a couple of years ago and i feel like they're a little finer so when i do go in with my pencil i usually thicken it up a little bit which is actually pretty good because this lays down a really good base for your brows when you are working on your brows but I just, I wouldn't mind it to be a little bit fuller. So let's go in and just start with that. Again, super love the brush tip on this wand. Just gonna apply this to my brow, especially to that bald area. I'm just gonna go straight across that lower line, just like you would with a brow pencil. And I'm just literally applying this where I would want the hairs to grow. Now this is also supposed to be super nourishing, like a conditioner even. So I'm super excited to wreak those benefits 100%. I'm just going to take the wand and dip it back into the component and I'm just going to take the product that's on here and just kind of, just like I would with a liquid liner, just run it right across my lash line. Not on the lashes themselves, just across the lash line, like that base of the lashes where they grow from. That's where you need to apply this. That was ridiculously easy to apply. It doesn't burn. It glides on easy. I have very sensitive eyes, so I'm excited to try this out. I'm taking you guys on this journey with me, so I'm going to continuously apply this product every day, twice a day, morning and night, and see how this wears and just see how this works. So I'm excited for that, so stay tuned for that. All right, I'm going to come right back, and it's going to be probably a couple of days from now. Hey guys, I'm just sitting in the studio and I thought I would jump on and share with you guys because I was just combing through some mascara. So clearly I have mascara on one side of my lashes, but I thought I would just jump on and talk to you guys. This is really making my lashes quite healthy. And as I'm combing through with my mascara and the mascara I'm using today is the Monsieur Big by Lancome. I love this one. And this is just really, really great. I'm combing through, it's giving them length when I've got the mascara on, obviously. But so far, for a week of using this product, I feel like it's really, really healthy. All right, so it's been about a week and a half. This is day 10, and honestly, the hardest thing is to remember to put this on in the morning. You do have to use it twice a day. For me, I get up sporadically. It could be four o'clock in the morning if I'm on set. It could be three o'clock. It could be two o'clock in the morning. So you have no idea when I'm going to wake up in the morning and to remember to put this on. That one's a little bit tricky, but I do do it. I have been using this twice a day for 10 days now. And honestly, the results are so-so. I feel like I'm still getting my regular hairs right here that grow in. Like these ones, again, I'm not waxing. I'm not, you know, doing anything crazy for you guys. I'm going to let all this grow out. I am trying really hard to get this right here to fill in, 
but I just feel like I'm getting some hairs popping up here, which is kind of the ones that I would normally go in and, you know, pluck or tweeze or whatever you want to call it. So, so far, the brows are looking pretty good. I feel like there is some hair growing there, maybe. Maybe it's just me. It is, it's early. It's day 10. But the lashes are looking good. Again, when you are using a lash serum, sometimes you do get like a purple line across the lid. Some lash serums in the past have done that for me. This one, no, I have not gotten anything like that so far. So I'm going to check in with you guys in a couple of days and I will let you know. So, so far, definitely seeing some growth happening here on my brows and where I want it to fill in, which is right here where I keep applying the product twice a day. This, it's, I'm not seeing anything, but again, you have to use it for four weeks plus not really seeing anything major to report back to you guys but nothing nothing bad's happening either so that's really positive and i am putting it on my lashes and on my lower lashes do i see any difference not yet but i thought i would check in with you guys see you soon okay it has officially been just over a month since I started using this and I wanted to come on here to sit down and tell you guys what I think about this brand new ordinary product. Honestly, let's just go through it. I'm going to show you guys really close up what this has done. Okay, let's look at this brow right here. This is the one that I have the issues with right here where it's just kind of like a bald patch and I've got the microblading there to fill it in, which has literally faded quite a bit. So I feel like not really much has grown in there over the month, but I feel like right here it is really starting to grow in if you want thicker brows. Right here, the hair just doesn't grow. For some odd reason, the hair just doesn't grow in that one little spot. But honestly, I kind of like what it's doing here. I have been putting it on and I do extend it kind of like outside my like brow, my brow line where I've got the microblading where it's tattooed on. But I have been putting it on and I, I am seeing results. So I think that's amazing. Now let's go into brow number two. Same thing. I'm definitely seeing results right here, but nothing kind of where I want it to kind of be filled in right there. Again, I understand it's only been just a little over a month. So this is going to take a little bit more time. Clearly it takes time for hair to grow. I am impressed with this. Let's talk about the lashes. Okay, so my eyelashes are super, super fine and I feel like they haven't grown terribly much. There is a little bit of a purple line starting here, but that's common with a lash product. Anything that you continuously put up there might cause a little bit of a purple tinge. Some lash products don't, some do. It depends what's in them. But this, honestly, I feel like it's so minimal, like it's not a big deal at all. But I feel like my lashes are super, super conditioned. Are they growing? I don't see any difference really for lashes, but I do feel like they're conditioned well, they're stronger. I do wear a lot of false lashes. You guys know this because obviously you guys are OGs to the channel and I wear a lot of lashes when I'm doing my videos. Like that is a thing. I wear magnetic lashes, I wear the glue on lashes. It's a lot on your eyelashes. So uh, it is what it is. My eyelashes are very fine and they haven't grown terribly much. I wasn't expecting miracle results. I do understand that it is going to take more than a month for, you know, some hair to grow and then actually grow the length of your lashes. So you're looking at six months at least to get, you know, that whole lash to grow out. So I am going to update you guys in the future. I will do something in a couple of months. I am going to continuously use this. I really do like the product quite a bit. It doesn't bother me at all when I put it on and I have really sensitive skin. I have sensitive eyes and I really love the product for that. Okay, girls, brass tacks here. This is an amazing product. It is affordable. This is only $7 and that's going to take you for six months of use to $42, which is insane. Like that's so super cheap. The next alternative for your cheapest bet to grow your lashes would be the black Jamaican castor oil and I have that right here so that's what this is I picked this up on Amazon I did try it once which isn't a big try obviously but you know you have to pick up these little bottles on Amazon too super messy to fill them up so I did that it's the same applicator I'll show you guys it is the exact same applicator so this one is a brush and you just pick up these bottles like I said on Amazon 
but this one is also the exact same little you know application tip as the ordinary has this product burned my eyes so if you have sensitive eyes I do not recommend this don't spend your money on this this is not for you it might work on some people it does not work for me but this product right here from the ordinary super affordable amazing and I do feel like it is giving me a lot of conditioning it isn't growing my lashes yet but it has only been a month so we are gonna come back to this in about six months and I will update you guys on this do I recommend it yes am i going to give it straight tens yes this is amazing i love it if you guys love videos like this don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so you guys don't miss when i drop a new video let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this 30 day wear test because i haven't done a video like this before and i'm just curious to know what you guys think all right guys talk to you soon Mwah. live love and the floss bye